going on you don't quite know where to look how hard have you been working on that really hard but ever since we knew we got through to the semis we've been working every day trying to get this routine as best uh, improve it as much as we could did you did you feel pressure did, did you feel there was any pressure on you because your first audition so well received yeah i mean the judges gave us great comments on the first mm. on the first audition so we really had to pull out all the stops to make sure that this one was better and no broken bones here no no we all, we are all, we're all all right that's good you well let's let's find out what the judges did think of it piers bloody hell <laughs> <laughs> I don't, I don't know how that came over at home on the TV, but I can tell you, in the room, that was one of the most extraordinary routines. You can imagine. And, I, I, you know, the big question we always ask at this stage, particularly when it goes live, is this. Could we imagine you gracing the Royal Variety Show, and in your case... fantastic ambassadors for Great Britain. I would love to see you go through to the final. You didn't disappoint. It was high voltage excellence. Well done. <laughs> Thanks, Amanda. Wow. Well, well, so, the first audition, what did you make of tonight? Well, you know, I've never seen anything in this country uh, as good as this. Normally, you know, it's, it's Cirque du Soleil or something like this. Um, I have to credit you and actually the guy who put this together because the detail on, on this routine is incredible. Um, and I agree with the guys, I, you know, this is what this show is all about. It's finding undiscovered talent and this, and you are that. Absolutely superb. Wow. Is that, is that more than you'd hope for, that kind of, yeah, that's kind of comment? Yeah, brilliant. We're, we're so pleased that they, you know, <laughs> that we've pleased everyone and we hope the audience at home feel the same. Yeah. Yes, look at him, he was on his feet there, there he is, look. <laughs> he's happy, he's happy, there he is. Uh, so, well done, you guys. Thank if you. you think Spellbound should be back here for the final this coming Saturday, then the number to call is 09011 Calls will cost you 50p from a BT landline, calls from other networks may be higher, mobiles will be considerably more. 15 pence from every vote goes to the Royal Variety Charity. Let's hear it one more time for the last act of the evening. Sure, and the lines are now open. Thanks for that. They will close during tonight's results show straight after Coronation Street. Red button viewers can vote by pressing their red button. Votes cast after the lines have closed will not be counted but may still be charged. And here are all the numbers you need. To vote for 3B, call 090 double one 32 22 01. If Olivia Archbold was your favourite, just add 02. To see Kevin Cruz into the final, add 03. If Stevie Starr is your choice, add 04. To see Tobias Mead back here on Saturday, all oh, no, no, on, double one, 32, 22 or 5. And 06, if Sean Sheehan gets your vote. If you think Josh Barry deserves to stay in the competition, add 07. To see Spellbound come back. Two acts can go through. Here's a quick reminder of all of tonight's talent and all the numbers you need. Turn him.
Could be going home, so get calling now. 15 pence from every vote goes to the Royal Variety Charity. Uh, right, that's it. We've now seen our first semi final, but we'll be back in half an hour, 9 30, for our new results show, and we have a performance from Diversity. Here we go. See you in half an hour.